Hey, what's going on internet? Josh Noel from Sunduck Film, a channel dedicated to teaching you After Effects and filmmaking techniques. So today we'll be looking at super slow motion and we will be using the plugin Twixter. And this is kind of what you can create with Twixter. So basically these very smooth slow motion shots. Um, all this was shot at 30 frames per second and you know, it is preferred to shoot at 60 frames per second, but uh, basically you can pull off these nice super slow motion shots with Twixer and I'm going to be showing you guys how you can do that today. So, so let's go ahead and get started. So let me go ahead and drag our clip into a new composition here. And let me go ahead and just first thing I'm going to do is go up to layer, pre-compose, and we'll just call this one and we'll uh, make sure move all attributes into new composition is selected and we'll click OK. And then what we'll do is we'll go to composition, uh, composition settings. And we'll go ahead and set this to like one minute now. So right now it's set to five seconds. Let's go ahead and set this to one minute. And we'll click OK. And we'll zoom out here. And let's go ahead and go to Effect, uh, Vision Plugins. And we'll go ahead and select Twixter. And we need to go ahead and set the input frame rate to our video frame rate, which is exactly 30 frames per second for me. So I'll go here and type in 30 frames per second. And as you can see, if you want to check the frame rate of your video, you can see that I'll say frame rate 30 right here. Um, see, frame rate is 30. So that's how you can check that out. And then um, I can go here to speed percentage and I can type in like 30%. So now this thing is going to be incredibly slow. Our only problem is, is that this uh, composition is not long enough. So what I need to do is double click this clip here and go into this composition and then go up to composition and go to composition settings and also set that to uh, one second or one minute for duration and then I can go back to our other comp and now we have this much longer um, you know shot because now it's set to 30 percent speed and that's basically you know how you do it so if you we, we might not want to render this entire clip because I might only need like three seconds of this clip so what we do is go to like a a point where we would want to cut this clip and say this it will hit enter our keyboard because this is going to be our out point and then we can just render pretty much just from here so that's pretty much how you use Twixter and um, it is a very powerful plugin but anyway guys if you enjoyed this video please drop a like it helps me out tremendously and if you haven't already please consider subscribing for more awesome tutorials like this and if you have any requests for tutorials or any questions, please drop a comment down below or hit me up on my social media networks, links in the description. And guys, thank you so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you soon.